Hello Earth Citizens! In this video, I will show you a 10 minute routine to do for foot reflexology self-massage. If you're not familiar with the concept of reflexology, it's a belief based on East Asian medicine that pressing different points on your feet and also on your hands corresponds to different areas of your body. So, you know, if you want to try to stimulate your brain, it's very hard to do when you try to push down because you have your skull right here. So it's not possible for you to access your brain by pushing on the literal brain. So reflexology believes that if you push on different areas, so for example, the brain is actually the top of your big toe like this. If you press here, it corresponds to that area. So you're able to release headaches, pressure from your head by pushing down on certain points on your feet. So we're going to learn some tricks of how to do self-massage and bring some healing energy to your body, your different organs using foot reflexology. So to help you guys out, I'm going to provide a handy little chart that we'll use to do our 10 minute routine today. So if you see on this chart, you can see that your left and right foot actually correspond to the whole structure of the left and right side of your body. So if you take a look, you can see it starts with your head on the top of your big toe, and then it goes to the eyes, and then the ears, and then on the left side where your heart is kind of on the upper part of your body. So on the upper part of your left foot on the left side where the heart is, you can see pressing that point will stimulate the heart. And then going down, the left side is more of your stomach, and that's because the stomach is on the literal left side of your body. The liver is on the right foot because the liver is on the right side of your body. And then you have your kidneys, your intestines, and then down to your knees and the other lower extremities of your body. So isn't it pretty cool? The, the foot reflexology chart sees your whole body on your whole foot. So you have your whole body on your whole foot. So now let's start with your head area. So on the top of your big toe is your head. If you have a lot of headaches, you can push down on this area. It doesn't matter which foot you do first. So let's just first do the right foot because I have my right leg up here. So let's just push down here, the head point. So when you push down, you can use your fingernails to push down, or if that's too harsh, you can use the, the place right under your nails or the fatty area of your thumb too. So push down here. And then now let's move down. So if you can see my foot, I can do it from the side here so you can see my foot a little bit better. So go down, down your big toe, and some parts when you push down here, you can feel some pain. Then you know, ah, I have some blockage in this corresponding area. So one thing to note, please, please, please do not try to memorize this chart. There's no point in trying to memorize this chart. You can just refer to this chart, but don't try to memorize it. It'll give you much of a headache. It'll stress you out even more. Unnecessary stress. The important thing is that you feel, when you push down, you'll feel some areas that have pain. Remember those areas, and then just look at the chart and say, ah, the corresponding organ here is blank. So now I know I have some blockage there. All right, now it's moved down towards the outside, towards your pinky toe. Push. I'm pushing with my fingernails because I feel like that gives me a little bit better stimulation. And then now move down to the little soft spot right above your arch. And you can see the corresponding organ there. And then now down to the outside towards your pinky toe. Use your two thumbs to push down. And 
and go down a little bit more, you can see this is your liver area. And then a little bit towards the center, your kidneys. And then now let's go down to your intestines, your arch area. Push down with your fingernails. Push down everywhere on the bottom of your feet. Breathe. And then now move down, down to your heels. And then with your heels, make your right hand into a fist and then use the pinky side to tap your heels. Tap your heels. Tap your heels. And now tap your whole foot, arch, up top, okay, and stop. And now place your thumbs in the middle right here where there's a soft spot above the arch below the ball. And with the fatty part of your hand, push out, push out like you're sliding out heavy energy out of your foot. So push and then like this, push like this, push, 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 push and outside all the way down your whole foot, even your heels push and out, push and out, push and out, push and out. This will help bring your circulation to your feet. Push and out. And now use the inside, this whole part of the inside of your palm to push out. So it's a little bit more than just your thumb. Use your whole inside of your palms to push out, push out, push out, push out. Great. Now let's switch feet. Switch feet. Switch. And the same thing here. Use your fingertips or the place right under your fingernail or the fatty part of your thumb. Let's start from the head, top of your big toe, and go down. Push. Again, don't try to memorize this chart, just feel your body. And now if you go down to this area, this is where your heart is. So pushing here will help with your heart according to reflexology. And then now back towards the soft spot right here, above the arch, below the ball. Now down to the arch, that's where your intestines are, right here. Stomach area, stomach and intestines. The stomach is on the left side. And then now down, keep pushing down. Now with your heel, make a fist again, using the pinky side, tap your heel. Tap, tap, tap. Up to the arch. To the ball. And now using the fatty part of your thumb, from the center, push out. From the center, push out. From the center, push out. Push out. Push out. 
And then now using the inside of your palm, your whole thumb and the inside here, push down and out. Down and out. Down and out. Down and out. Your whole foot. Okay, great job. How do your feet feel? Do they feel a little bit lighter, maybe less puffy than before? You can try this anytime you have some foot pain or anytime you want to work some internal areas of your body but you can't access them. So this will help you release tension from your internal organs as well. You did a great job. And again, don't try to memorize this chart. That's not the point. The more important part is that you, as you massage and push down on your own feet, you can recognize if I have pain in a certain point, I know what organ or what body part it corresponds to. So that gives me a clue as to what I need to work on. That's the more important part. You did a great job. To experience a full one hour brain education based class, please visit a local body and brain yoga studio near you.